Andrew ghosted me. Uh, we matched on Bumble, so we texted first, and we realized that we both had dogs. So for our first oh. date, we decided to meet at a dog park with our dog. That's a typical that dog really parent fun. move. <laughs> yeah. So, okay, I have a two-year-old fox terrier. Her name is Muffin, oh. and Andrew has a Doberman named Cosmo. <laughs> they were so cute together, and we got along so I... well, and we were talking, and it was just like, boom, boom, boom. He's so cute. I really liked him, but here's the thing a little ways into the date our dogs they started freaking out and just not getting along oh, like at first no. it was fine so they weren't yeah, vibing and they, they were nipping at each other and after a while we couldn't even really get a conversation going because we had to keep kind of interjecting with them and separating them hmm. so it got it kind of cooled off a little when that happened hmm. and we actually kind of had to leave because it was kind of getting kind of crazy hmm. you know I figured it was just kind of a temporary thing and we'd figure that out later and I texted him a little like had a great time and I never heard back and I'm worried it's because of the dog. Here's the deal after this song we're gonna call him. You're gonna be silent on the phone and we're gonna find out from him why he ghosted you. It's gonna be a bit awkward for, for us but at least you get to hear it. All right I'm All right. ready. Hello? Is this Andrew? Uh yeah who's this? Andrew my name's Adam Wilde. It's nice to meet you. <laughs> like oh, uh, <laughs> Adam Wilde from Virgin Radio yes. Yeah uh, um I did I win something? You did not. <laughs> you did not. I mean, listen, you didn't win anything specifically right now. We're actually calling you awkwardly about uh -huh. a date that you were on with Cosmo with somebody named Nikki. Okay. Mm. What happened with you and Nikki? Like, you never called her back. Uh, um, this is all very weird. Um never been on the radio before and now you guys want me to talk about a date that's that I went exactly on? what we want we to do. do yeah welcome so we went to a, a dog park because uh, we met on uh on bumble and we were talking and it was mostly about about dogs and she has uh, a fox terrier and i have a doberman so we just thought you know we could go to a dog park and then the dog could run around and have fun, and then we could stand still and have fun, and it would be <laughs> it would be a good okay. time. And I mean, it, it was, and she's great and fun personality, it's super high energy, which I love because I'm not, and and she's super attractive, <laughs> like total total package. Great. Uh, the dogs fought a lot, and okay. we had to, yeah. And I think she cared about that a lot more than. I did. Oh. Not that I don't care about my dog, but like Dog's my dog could take her dog. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. <laughs> sure. Uh, Weird flex, but okay. okay. <laughs> I'm just flexing for my dog because he can't right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, Cosmo so, doesn't need you to flex for Cosmo. Like it sounds like it was nice and yeah, lovely. Yeah, you got to stand yeah. still and talk. It was great. Yeah. I called her mommy. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. What? Did not, you call her mother or did you call not, her not, mother? I, I I called her mommy and <laughs> it wasn't like it was a, it wasn't like a thing that I was trying to do. Like I don't go on dates just so I can have this opportunity to call women mommy. Like that's not. A I would hope not. I think I, that's not what I do. It was like a Freudian slip and oh, that. No, no, no. Yeah. <sighs> I'm still not sure if you actually <laughs> called her mother or called her mommy by name. And and then I want to know, and I'm not sure if I do want to know, but I do want to know, oh. under what circumstances yeah. did you call her mom? So I did not call uh, her mother on no. the phone. Okay, Thank all right, God. well, that's ruled out. Good. So you straight up called her mommy? Yeah. Yeah. Why? Uh, How? Yeah. <laughs> Context, please. Uh, so have you guys ever, like, when you were in school... Do you ever accidentally call like a teacher mom or something? Yeah, yeah when yeah. I was a child. <laughs> 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 okay, so let's make fun of me more. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh, poor guy, Jack, he's out here. <laughs> I don't know what to do. There's so much going so, on. <laughs> we were talking about cooking, and usually when I'm talking about cooking, I'm talking about cooking with my own mommy, <laughs> my real mommy, and. I don't know, we were talking about like pasta or something and I said something along the lines of, I can cook a really mean roasted uh, garlic and herb sauce, mommy. What? Uh, 
and I it haunts me to my soul. It should. Yeah. <laughs> it, thank you. Um, <laughs> So, so you obviously <laughs> felt humiliated. Yeah, and it happened. So I actually just used the dogs fighting as an excuse to run away. Ew, that makes me so sad. Oh my god! By the way, I mommy's on the line. I- yeah, Andrew. Uh- <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, my brain's exploding. I remember oh. that happening, but it was uh, it was just it was like funny. It was funny. Didn't we laugh about it? And we talked about uh, how you act how how sometimes you, you actually say like I love you when you're walking away from someone, but you just mean to say like bye, see you later. We should tell it them was- more of my secrets. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, we've done that too. I gotta say, this is really funny. Yeah. <laughs> this is very funny. <laughs> like, this is, uh, Andrew, the self ownage right here is just amazing. <laughs> um, but you know, what I respect the most about you is A, you didn't freak out when you found out Nikki was on the phone and listening to this. B, you didn't freak out when I knew way too much about you and C, that you were honest enough to say, here's what happened and it ain't pretty. Yeah, you stay, you were incredibly uncomfortable this entire time, but you stayed with us. Yeah, yeah. yeah. that's yeah. guts, yeah. man. Um, yeah. It's kind of like, the the Hulk. The secret is I'm always freaked out. <laughs> <laughs> sure. You should meet our friend TJ. Yeah. You sound like a kindred <laughs> spirit. Andrew, if you're in for it, Nikki obviously is because she called us and, and she really liked you. And I feel like I'm in grade seven again saying, you know, Nikki likes you. Yeah. She really likes you. It sounds like you liked her. Called her the complete package. I don't know how much of a better compliment you can get from that after the first date. Why not a second date? And if you do... We'll pay. We'll pick up the tab. Doesn't matter what you guys want to do. I mean, I know dog park walking is mm. free, but we'll actually yeah. like send you a place where you can get a meal, maybe without the dogs fighting in the background. No, I mean, I would, I would love to. I definitely enjoyed the first day, and Nikki's great, and Yay. so I would love to go on it. I just uh, caveat: please never ever talk about uh, me calling you mommy uh, ever again. <laughs> <laughs> It's a deal. I, yeah. It's a deal. <laughs> I promise only to call you about it on the radio so everyone can know. Yeah. Ah, oh, yeah. Good. Don't good. do that. Good. That's a fair compromise. Can yeah. I just say round of applause? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Round of applause. <laughs> this, see, this is what ghosting is all about. It's always some stupid reason. Yeah. And then we make a phone call and they're like, well, yeah, we both liked each other. We just couldn't get yeah. over this embarrassing one thing. That's all you got to do, though. See? That's Communicate. right. Communicate. Also, um, Nikki, I have an idea for your Halloween costume. Oh, yeah. S- Oh, but yes. <laughs> say it. Say it. Oh, I want to hear you say it. You should be a mummy. No. Hey! <laughs> I had to. It was right there. Andrew, <laughs> Nikki, we'll be in touch about where, you know, let us know where you're going, and then we'll try to hook you up with a gift card to that. And, wow. and congratulations to the both of you for making through this. <sighs> Andrew, you're painfully honest. You got lots of guts. We really like you. Nikki, you sound like a, a blast, and I'm sure your dogs will eventually get along, guys. Yeah, you sound like a good mummy. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you. I'm excited. Andrew, you don't have to thank us, man. You should thank your mom. We should be thanking you. Sorry, darling.